hello everyone welcome back in this video we'll see the optional task uh, 9 in lab 6 replicate an amazon s3 bucket across aws regions so here let's enable versioning on our source bucket so let me go to the s3 okay and uh, click on the bucket okay click on the properties tab and uh, here you can uh, locate the bucket versioning and click on edit so here you can click on enable for bucket versioning and save changes okay next uh, we'll create a destination bucket for cross region replication okay so under buckets you can click on create bucket and you need to put the unique uh, bucket name here okay so here let me put the uh, scg bucket 02 and uh, the aws uh, region so this time i'm going to choose uh, us east one Okay, and uh, block public access settings. Here you can unselect, and uh, here you can you know check this box. I acknowledge that uh, the current setting might result in this bucket and object within becoming public. okay so here for bucket versioning you can click on enable and create bucket okay so it is not recommended to enable the public access uh, but just for the quick testing i just uh, removed that uh, block okay so now we can see that uh, the bucket 02 which is created and uh, now let's configure a public uh, read policy for the new destination bucket okay you can click on the buckets okay so from here we can choose the or uh, the destination bucket which will be the one which we created and uh, you can click on the permission tab and here under the bucket policy you can click on edit Okay, so this is the bucket uh, ARN. Okay, and uh, let's put this JSON into this editor. Okay, and uh, put this destination bucket uh, in this resource ARN and add slash asterisk so that uh, 
all the you know objects will get the permissions okay and uh, click on save changes so here we can see that uh, bucket details page and uh, notice that uh, there is a red warning which is uh, public okay so next uh, we'll create a replication rule okay click on the buckets and uh, choose um, the first bucket that we created and uh, under the management tab you can you know locate the replication rules and uh, create replication rule and you can put the replication rule name my cross region replication and uh, make sure the source bucket is the one which we created uh, first and this is the source region and uh, under choose a rule scope you can choose apply to all object uh, in the bucket and uh, under the destination you know you can uh, click on browse s3 and select the destination bucket uh, that we created uh, second time bucket 02 under uh, use us east one region and click on choose path and uh, under the iam role okay so here we have two option choose from the existing iam role okay and uh, leave it with the choose from existing iam role and uh, here click on this choose iam role and uh, click on create a new role okay and uh, leave the other options default and you can click on save okay you can see that uh, replicate uh, existing object here you can select no do not replicate uh, existing object then choose submit okay so the replication configured uh, successfully and you can press the refresh button if the changes to the configuration are not displayed okay so next uh, we'll verify object replication so you can click on buckets and uh, click on this first bucket that we created okay and uh, click on images click on upload click on add files and uh, here you can maybe choose logo 2 and upload okay upload succeed um, here we can choose uh, logo2.png from files and uh, folders okay let me Go back to the buckets. 
let me delete this Okay, let me upload a new one with the JPG format. So I'm uploading AWS. Okay, you can click on this image. Okay, so here under the object uh, management overview section, here we can see that uh, the replication status, it says uh, pending. So we need to wait for this to be reflected. Okay, so now we can see that uh, the replication status completed. Okay, so in the bucket session, uh, now let's go to the uh, the second bucket that we created and go to the images. And now you can see that uh, the two images that we newly uploaded, uh, you know, got replicated to the destination bucket, which is the second bucket. Uh, Okay, so here if you open the uh, image and under object uh, management overview, it says that uh, it's a replica. So it's a replica from the uh, bucket one. Okay, and uh, this is the object URL which we can copy and paste it. So since we have allowed the public access, we are able to access the URL as well. All right, so we have completed uh, setting up a cross region replication for all new object uh, uploaded in the bucket because the old object uh, is not uh, replicated because we have not, uh, you know, choose that option. But in case if you have a requirement, you can do that. Okay, so that's it in this video and I'll see you in the next.